setup mode. After setting all the configuration mode parameters, we now have to set the control terms and alarm values. This is done in setup mode. Let's look first of all at the controller model. To enter the setup mode, press the up and down keys simultaneously for about three seconds. The yellow light will come on. With the controller, the first parameter is SP, the set point value. We can enter the set point value, AL1, the alarm value, AL2, the second alarm value, filter, as a digital filter, so we can put in the filter time for the input signal, an offset if required, a cycle time for the controller, a set point lock. At the moment it is off. So what that means, let me just come out of this mode, is the set, set point can be altered by the operator in normal operation mode. Normal operation, here is the set point. The operator can change it. What we can do to prevent the operator from being able to change the set point so in back in process mode is in the setup mode uh, this parameter SPL at the moment it's off we can turn it on with the set point lock on then the operator in the normal operation mode cannot change that set point. Back into the setup mode again. Alarm enable. At the moment I have this controller programmed um, for the alarms to be enabled or changed if required from the front of panel display in normal operation mode. For example, I'll come out of the of this menu. In the normal operation mode, alarm 1 is 40, but the operator can change it. Now we may not want this. We may not want him to be able to change the alarm settings. So in setup mode, we have an alarm enable or disable. If we set AEN from enable to disable, then when we're back in the normal operating mode again, the operator cannot change the alarms. You can't even see what the alarms are. All he has access to is the set point, and if the set point lo is lock is on, he can't change that either. Let's put the let's put it back to enable. Okay. So now to exit the setup mode, display any parameter. We want the legend, not the value. So we want SP, for example, not 75. So we get to the legend, press the up and down keys for three seconds, and we're now out of the setup mode. Now let's have a look at the indicator. Very, very similar. To enter, up and down keys together for about three seconds. Filter, this is a digital filter. Offset if we wanted one. Alarm enable. At the moment the operator can change the alarm values if he wanted to from the front of panel. Um, let's disable it. Alarm 1 is at 120. This is where we put change, 
the engineer would put the alarm settings so let's change that from 120 down to 100 alarm 2 is the alarm 2 value and then we're back to the beginning of the menu again come out of this menu again up and down keys for about 3 seconds and the only only thing that the operator can see in, in normal operation mode is just the process value there's nothing else that the operator can see or alter for further details about N2300 please contact us via our website www.wardindustries.co.uk you can also telephone our UK phone number 01933 624 963. For calls outside the UK, the international dial code is 0044. Thank you.